I'm Dennis Llewellyn Hall and I'm an artist based in Wales and I'm making an exhibition based on the, uh, the site up and down the Offers Dyke monument and footpath and it'll be really a ramble actually, a ramble of both the, the landscape and encountering the people along the way, chatting with them and finding out really, building up a picture, portrait really of, of the dyke and what it represents in, in modern day terms. The dyke was built by King Offa in the uh, 8th century, an Anglo-Saxon king of Mercia. And the dyke was built for reasons a bit unclear, but largely assumed that it was a division, a border between England and Wales. At the time it was built by King Offa, possibly to have kept the, the Welsh out of um, England. And thankfully for that, it has preserved our culture and, its, and our language. Uh, to, to the greater extent and as I'm, I believe really has forged this very clear identity of a of nationhood. I'll be using guidebooks to steer me along the route so uh, 177 miles is a long way to walk and you obviously need maps for that and the maps will help me to then meet the people. I'll be walking with both guides and uh, guests of, who I invite along on the path to walk with me and we're meeting poets, particularly on the way, 12 of which have been commissioned to write a new poem for each section of the dyke. So this is a project I've always wanted to do. I've always really been fascinated by what this dyke is, what it represents. It'll, it'll involve conversations with people who are very much uh, inherently part of it, who live on or near it, um, have daily excursions around it. So I'm very keen to get to the, to the bottom of what this this bit of the landscape, this huge swathe of um, a monument spanning north to south, what it represents.